College of Art and Built Environment of the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology organizes National Construction Summit at the Great Hall on the 19th and 20th September 2018. The theme for the Maiden National Construction Summit was 60 years of the Ghanaian construction industry, that is, uniting for industrialization. The program started with a welcome address by the Provost of the College of Art and Built Environment, Professor Joshua Ayakwa. The chairman for the program was the Pro Vice Chancellor of KNUST, Reverend yes, Professor Charles Ansan. Thank the Lord this morning, especially for our keynote speaker. And I believe that my eyes are now open on a lot of things. The main presentation was done by the and Deputy General, General Manager, in Investment and Infrastructure of SNIT, Mr. Seth and Chu. So I believe a number of the things we are going to talk about relate specifically to the real estate, but <clears throat> they will also relate to other construction activities. He spoke on the past and present situational analysis of the Ghanaian construction industry, that is, the SNIT perspective. You agree with me that without land, there is no construction. As it was said, you can't build castle in the air. You have to bring it on the ground. So, the first thing to think about when you think of construction is land. In Ghana, our land channel system hasn't helped at all. We have a system overlapping statutory and customary ownership. The process of also acquiring title to land is generally time consuming and contributes significantly to delays in construction. So they put it on, put in the claim and sit down and wait. If you haven't paid they can do the rest. Currently, we have contractors working on projects which worth over 2 million Ghana cities, who can raise on their own 4,000 Ghana cities. 4,000 Ghana cities. The special guest was Ashanti Regional Minister, Mr. Simon Osei Mensa who stood in for the senior minister, Honorable Yao Osafo Maf. The province of the College of Art and Built Environment, Professor Ndapa. According to John, Jim John, what you build and how you build it will end up building. This simply means as built environment professional, quality of your work is what you should do, what should propel you into higher heights. Therefore, you must be committed to showcasing your capacity, improving your skills, and building the needed partnerships so that you can deliver to the highest construction standards that meet the expectation of your clients. In an interaction with Mr. Set Chum on land acquisition in Ghana, this is what he said. Land, they have been developed. People encourage and they find people to go and police it and the policing of the land is what has brought about land guards and that's why I said that security agencies should continue the effort to stamp it out, weed it out of the system. Tech TV, experience educational television.